Well, these last five years, I, they were very exciting, very eventful. And uh, because of my friends, and um, I retired from work, and I could get out and go to church, uh, where I made wonderful friends. And uh, those friends, uh, uh, they prayed for me and with me. And uh, we did Bible studies together. And um, I just was allowed to speak and become free and become myself. And uh, the light that I feel in this church and the people, you know, it's just Jesus is still working on me. I mean, he will never be finished until I die. But the journey is amazing, and every step that I take, uh, it's, a, it's a better one. And I do it at peace. I don't do it all shaken, nervous. Uh, I don't have to make excuses. I can speak freely, and I can be open, and I can love Jesus and all that he provided for me. Um, I feel the love of the Lord in my life, and He is calling me to go out and share what He has done for me, how He has loved me, protected me, and provided for me. Uh, meaning, uh, being baptized today uh, means that um, my previous life and sins are forgiven, and because Jesus paid the price for me on the cross, and he came back so I can have life and joy the way he wanted me to be uh, from the very beginning. And uh, I want to be this light. Marianne, you are his light. I first met you at Starbucks and you make a mean cup of coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you have a seat? And it is a privilege for Rosalie and I to baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and the Holy Spirit.